to better understand how constant definitions work when they are used, we can calculate using the same step-by-step -step equations that we used before to understand chained operations. So here's a simple example. Uh, we're just overlaying a cat on top of a dog. And in the first step of this calculation, what happens is that the name cat gets replaced by its value, which is the actual cat image. And the name dog gets replaced by the actual dog image. That's the first step. And then in the second step, the overlay operation happens. And that actually takes the two images and overlays them together. And we could see the same step-by-step -step process using the stepper as well in an automatic way. So if we click the step button in the upper right corner, we can see what happens when the definition cat is used. Cat here is a name and on the right, you can. it's a little hard to see because it's hard to highlight an image, but the cat image on the right is actually highlighted in purple. So the name cat highlighted in green on the left is replaced by the actual cat image highlighted in purple on the right. So that's the first step. And then if we click next, we see that uh, the cat image is in, but the second step is for the dog name to be replaced by the dog image. Again, on the left, the name dog is in green. On the right, the dog image is in purple. So that's the second step. And finally, the third step is to overlay these two images into a single image. That is overlay at work. Let's see another example. Here we have a definition of small dog. And in order to figure out what small dog is, we have to scale by 0.3 the image dog. But we only have the name dog. So in order to even process the definition of small dog, we have to first substitute the image dog for the name dog. And that's what's happening in this step. And then we can actually scale that image so that the name small dog is defined to be the small dog. One last example. Here is the place image operation, which takes as two of its four inputs, the small dog and the cat. So in order to process this operation, first I have to look up what a small dog is. And that's what's happening here. The name small dog becomes the actual small dog image that we just scaled down. And then the name cat becomes the actual cat image. And finally, the place image happens where the two images are combined into one. So these are the step-by-step -step equational calculations that we could use to better understand what happens when we use a constant that we defined.